adding windows and doors into shape library uh, shape library add to leap tool uh, which is in create uh, tab geometry and future arch library section uh, with these two we can easily add windows and doors into shape library and then use them use them with a window tool on these three testing objects uh, I will show you how to add each specific window and door and frame uh, into library adding into window and uh, door uh, library is uh, pretty much same there is no difference between window and door and how to add them into library so first I will start with this simple window first we need to select window then activate add to lip tool then click uh, no then uh, set library type so uh, it is properly set now it's it's a window and click into top viewport when where the object is lying now we can see we have uh, four different uh, buttons here uh, to set up uh, additional options but first we we need to set a subtype it is uh, it is correct now it is front wall it can be front wall and front back wall simple windows simple doors uh, should be uh, added as a front wall sub subtype because we need to offset them so we need to define just a front wall and nothing else okay now setting up uh, the intervals uh, I will enlarge this and when you activate interval button you can see you can set intervals along x y and z axis but what are intervals? Uh, intervals defines uh, how objects should be stretched on the wall so uh, you define with intervals along x y and z uh, where uh, each object should be stretched and where it should be uh, fixed so uh, along x we want to uh, have this part fixed also this part so frame along x will be fixed and the rest of the object can be stretched same for uh, y axis so now intervals are defined set wall by default is this proper because it is on the front of the object and it defines where the wall front wall is beginning so I will leave it as this Hole, uh, hole is by default uh, bounding box of the object so it is properly set uh, if we need to change it we can with rectangle tool or polyline tool so this hole defines where wall object will be drilled and last one two rectangle for this object again it is properly set by default because it defines bound, bounding box uh, of the, of the uh, object now uh, just use uh, but be before you add this into library I will uh, create a new uh, directory folder so create a new library I'll name it test and into new test library I will add this shape as a window test okay so first object is, is done as the next object we will add this uh, simple door object but uh, before this uh, we will add uh, element handle on this uh, door object element handle uh, is here in Arcris elements and we will use a uh, single pivot a uh, single pivot handle so anything from this so let oh, okay this simple okay I will attach this on the uh, door object uh, let's say here okay it doesn't matter this element when it is added as a separate object and it is created by element tool from our plugin uh, if this object is uh, added uh, together with this door then uh, when you stretch the door this element will be always same dimension so it will be not it will be not uh, uh, stretched and uh, sometimes we can achieve same with intervals but sometimes sometimes it is not possible because some parts are overlapping so 
uh, it is uh, very useful to create uh, these some elements, uh, some add some elements, other elements, and uh, then uh, we don't need to care about uh, stretching of this object. So now I will select both of, both of these objects, so doors and also this uh, handle element, and using again uh, add to leap tool, clicking to top viewport, and now we can define intervals again. So along along x. We want to have fixed. We don't need to have. Uh, we do, do need to care about this handle. This will be not stretched because uh, it is element. It is. We are adding this as an element. And uh, I will use these intervals only on these parts. We want to keep this part fixed. Rest can be stretched. So along x, also along y axis okay one more time okay and here this part will be fixed uh, rest is same as previous example so wall is properly set whole and two rectangle uh, is a bounding monk so we will leave it uh, as default and uh, also, this subtype is default front wall, uh, so we will add this as a door handle handle test. Of course, if we don't want to have perfect parametric door and or window uh, with perfect parametric handle we don't need to uh, set up these intervals we don't need to uh, add uh, handles or parts as elements we can just uh, add simple object and when we will be not stretching it too much then uh, uh, it doesn't matter but w if we want to keep the proper dimension even if we stretch object we have to set up these intervals and also uh, uh, add handle on as an element so next object uh, and last one uh, is this frame so I will just select it and again add to a leap tool click into top viewport and now in this object uh, I will show you all these options for starting with intervals so I will uh, set intervals along N uh, yeah, and uh, of course this object is now subtype a front back wall because we need to stretch this object from the front wall to back wall. So we need to uh, define subtype to front back wall. Uh, now uh, intervals, intervals along uh, x axis. So we will we'll fix this part along y axis. We will fix this part, this can be stretched up to top and here. OK. Going to here on the left viewport so we can, or rather here. Here we can see that this frame uh, has some uh, start and end part and middle part so how it should be placed on the wall so uh, when when we have front back wall option and we set wall now we're defining two two uh, two sides of the wall so first here front wall will be somewhere here and back wall will be some somewhere here so with this front and back we will define where a wall is starting and well where it is ending and something in between uh, this will be stretching also we need to fix intervals along the z axis here from the start wall to here so i will set interval here on this start part and also on the back part so now everything uh, 
which, uh, which is uh, um, in front of the wall will be fixed and everything which is uh, on the back of the wall will be also fixed along that axis and in the middle we can stretch it so these are intervals set wall and now hole so I will go back here into top viewport for the hole uh, we want to have a hole let's say with rectangle somewhere here starting here because this will define okay how the wall will be drilled with this uh, with this frame so it must a little bit overlap the edge uh, where where the door uh, are placed and uh, now we will also define the two rectangle because with two rectangle now we are uh, defining where are actual door actual actual rectangle of the door so how this uh, frame will be placed and it will start here in this corner and end this down on the down corner so now you can see the wide rectangle is two rectangle red rectangle is a whole rectangle so when you draw this uh, frame you will be drawing rectangle as it is uh, white wide rectangle and hole will, will be drilled uh, uh, along the red line this is much complicated than than a simple window and door but uh, it is necessary to add it at this uh, this way so now just add it into library it will be frame test okay and finally we can test uh, new objects uh, so I will create some uh, testing wall and with a window tool setting our test folder first window you can see the intervals uh, are fixed so frame is fixed it's working uh, we can offset this window also door door is working pretty much good so you can see when we stretching doors paths which should be fixed are fixed and even handle is fixed so it is always same handle okay this is door object and finally uh, we will test the frame so now frame as you can see it is adjusted to wall uh, and intervals working and also we can set a second layer and add here our testing door okay so we can see together frame and door are working uh, perfectly well because of two rectangle define two rectangle and also uh, define the hole so as you can see uh, you can uh, create a, a windows doors and frames very easily and then make a lot of combination of, of these objects